Hello, hello. Welcome back. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back. Welcome back. How are you? Ready for action like Jesse Jackson. Let's get it on like Donkey Kong. Long and strong to the break of down. How you hello, doing? Hello, teacher. How are you? Ah, very good. Hey, good evening. Good evening. Good How evening, are you teacher. today? How do you feel? You feel good? Yes, I yeah. feel good. I feel good. Na, 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 na. <laughs> like James Brown, I feel good. That's right, like James Brown. Welcome back, guys. Thank you for uh, attending your English class. I hope that everybody had a very good um, day. My day was excellent. I had an awesome day uh, working and um, good, good properties. Um, at this moment, I would like for uh, somebody to tell me uh, what information do you remember about the previous class? What information can you tell me from the previous class? Somebody? Yes, teacher. Yes, Go ahead. We were, we were talking about common medications. That is correct. Can you give me some examples? Common medications? Okay, whenever I have a headache, uh, I take aspirin. Correct. Correct. Whenever I have a headache, I take an aspirin. Perfect. Somebody else can give me another example. Whenever my hand hurts, I mm -hmm. take um, ibuprofen. 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 That's right. Very good. Okay. Excellent, guys. Um, at this moment, do you have any questions referring to the activities that we were doing yesterday? Do you have any questions referring to these activities? Mm. Questions about vocabulary, questions about uh, pronunciation, questions about <laughs> meaning or anything like that from yesterday's class? Um, solo preguntar, teacher, que en el caso de que estemos mencionando o hablando de cómo se siente una tercera persona en una oración, el verbo cambia. I'm sorry, repeat that. I didn't understand the question. El verbo cambia cuando nosotros mencionamos cómo se siente una persona, otra persona. Cuando es en tercera persona. Uh, Por ejemplo, cuando es de she, it... Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes. Uh, for example, if I say to you, uh, if you say, for example, my father, my father feels sick. Okay. Or if you say you feels sick sick. So in this context, I want you to see that the first one in third person singular, as you can see, we are going to add the S, S. in mm -hmm. the verb. Okay. But in first person, no S is necessary. Okay. Mm -hmm. sí que tenía esa duda. Gracias. Yes, correct. Very good question. Thank you for your question. Sure. Hi. If, if we use... Uh, have in, in the third person mm -hmm. is has. Correct. My, my father feels sick because he has an act in, in head, headache. Feels example. sick, correct. Because he has a headache. Okay, or if you say, for example, uh, in first person, uh, you feel sick because because you have a headache right so in this case uh feels has an s because it's my father and has is the auxiliary uh, verb for the possessive no, but in the first person, you, it feels, doesn't have an S, and we use the auxiliary have. 
Good job, Roberto. Okay. Yes, very good. Excellent. Uh, any more questions related to this topic? Does anybody else have another question related to this topic? No, teach. Okay. No, I'll teach now, everything is clear. Excellent. Please ask me the questions if you have a question. Okay. Don't don't stay with the question. Give me the question and I will help you. Now, for the next activity, we're going to be looking at section. 2.7 lesson objective. By the end of this class, you will learn how to use positive and negative imperatives. Additionally, you will also practice a conversation which illustrates how this topic is used in a real life setting. Al final de esta clase, ustedes aprenderán cómo usar los imperativos positivos y negativos. Adicionalmente, ustedes practicarán una conversación la cual ilustra cómo este tema es usado en un escenario de la vida real. Don't work too hard. Um, antes que nada, ¿quién me puede decir qué es un imperative? ¿Para qué es el imperative? ¿A dónde lo uso? ¿Para qué lo uso? ¿Qué es un imperative? Imperative is a verb to give orders. Mm -hmm. Correct. Correct. For example, okay. for example, the teacher, the teacher says, um, stand up. Right? Parece? That's an imperative. No, 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 don't do it. It's only an example. Okay, sit down, sit down. <laughs> uh -huh. O tú dices, pasa adelante. Come in. Es un imperative. Ah? Don't smoking. Ah, uh, no smoking. No smoking in this area. That's really not an imperative. That's more like a rule. In un, un imperative empieza con un verbo. So, no smoking no puede ser imperative. Eh, un imperative sería, por ejemplo, pasa adelante. Come in. Es imperative. Tome asiento. Sit down. Es un imperative. De pie, stand up. Es un imperative. Um, le dice usted al perro, hey, fuera, fuera, fuera. Get out. Es un imperative. Um, no o, le no dice, o le dice al niño, eat. Es un imperative. Mm -hmm. okay. Básicamente, órdenes. Mm -hmm. Ok, uh, let's look at the following. José David. Okay, David, comprendo. Gracias. All right, let's look at the next activity, which is don't work too hard. All right, esto es para las personas que trabajan mucho, así como Mr. Santos, que trabaja de sol a sol. <laughs> <laughs> Pero echado en la maca. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Si no fuera yo, no me lo creía. Yeah. yeah, incredible. You know, jamás pensé que podía generar un ingreso echado en la maca. O sea, it's crazy. ¿Quieren escuchar una venta de las que hice ahora? Para, yes. para, yes. para salir de la rutina. Ok, yes. estas son las bendiciones que le vienen a Mr. Santos en un... ¿Qué día es hoy? En un... Ahora es martes, miércoles. En un miércoles. Wednesday. En un miércoles por la tarde. Wednesday. Today, guys, was an awesome day for me. Fue un día incredible. Si no hubiera sido yo, no lo hubiera creído. Ok, Maureen, les voy a enseñar a Maureen, porque esta ya el, mañana la firman. Listen, please. Se escucha una palabra que no entiende, la escribe. Can everybody hear? Can you hear? Yeah. 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 
Hello. Hello, Maureen. Hello, Maureen. Yes. Hi, this is Michael King. I spoke with you the other day. Remember? I remember. Yes, I do. Okay. So I already scheduled a visit. Uh, with my senior manager. He's going to be mm -hmm. there on Saturday. Is Saturday morning good for you? Let's say around 10? No, you know, it's it's not because um, I have a funeral. My uncle passed away. I have mm -hmm. a funeral on um, Saturday morning, exactly. Oh, okay. 11, 11 what, about, what about Friday? How does Friday afternoon look like around 3 or 4? Uh, okay. Wake is at four, uh, through, uh, through nine. So earlier than that would be okay. What about like, uh, Thursday, Thursday morning or Thursday afternoon? Is better for me, yes. Thursday I'm open. Thursday, okay. All right, yeah, so I'm where are we sketch. visiting? Where, where are we visiting? Uh, do you want to come to us or do you want me to come to you? We would prefer to go there because I need to take pictures of the house. I told you that I'm in New York. Okay. So how could I how could I do to get in there? Um, does the association have the keys? Could they let me in? Um, yeah, I, a friend of mine has the keys. I can get that information for you. I just have to remember who's got my keys these days. Okay. This is the property, guys. This is the property. Uh -huh. This is the property right here, and this is the this is the market value, and uh, the property is one Sorry, bed, one bedroom, teacher. One bathroom. Uh huh. No se escucha bien. Alguien tiene el micrófono encendido. Oh, oh, sorry, sorry. Okay, so this is the property right here. It's a beautiful property, as you can see. Um, it has a very nice balcony. The lady, she lives in New York, Paradise Harbor. Ahí está mi carro. ¿Vieron mi carro? Este es mi red Mustang. <laughs> it's a joke. Uh -huh. <laughs> Tengo moto. <laughs> okay. uh, th this is the harbor. This is Miami Beach. So, esta es la propiedad que, que me va a vender. Right? This is the case right here. This is the kitchen, bedroom, bathroom, beautiful. So? Wow, teacher. That's right. That's that's what <laughs> I do. That's what I do. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Y quiere que la visite mañana. Mañana ya va a ver. No terminé la llamada, verdad? Give me a second. Adelantar. information, but we wanted to go on detail with the case with my manager first, right? And right. then to see if we were going to get into it. And it seems right, like we right. can cover everything, so you know, we okay. might as well do it. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay, all right. And what's, what's in it for me? What, what is there any, any movement in there for me? Well, um, we can try to get you something on the settlement. Um, mm -hmm. Uh, my senior manager is willing to put up the attorney fees. So that right, right there okay. is, uh, you know, and we'll see what the bank accepts. Remember that we got to make an offer. Okay. Okay. So um, I'm going to, I'm going to call you. Um... So that's what I do guys all day. Nice teacher. In the hammock, drinking coffee. Me siento me. <laughs> Incredible. Hammock yeah. is hamaca. Hammock is hamaca. Tengo dos, una en, en la habitación y una en el jardín. So. Teacher, ¿cuál es el secreto? <laughs> practice, 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 practice. Eh, pues yo empecé a hacer esto por la pandemia. Porque yeah. cuando empezó la pandemia, yo antes de eso yo era full-time teacher. Solo, solo programas con Ensafor, visitaba empresas. That was it. Ya cuando llegó la pandemia, pues obviamente ya no podía ir afuera ni a dar clases. So me rebusqué y saqué este cliente en Miami. Y 
gracias a Dios, estoy cachetón. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So you can do it too, guys. Si en el futuro ustedes perfecciona su inglés y quiere un trabajo conmigo, yo lo pongo en mi equipo. Easy money. Oh. <laughs> Thank you, teacher. Okay. That's right. That's right. Aparte de ser acquisitions manager, también soy el capacitador y el recursos humanos si, si yo lo traigo. All right, let's look at the conversation. Everybody listen, please. Hi, everyone. In this class, you learn how to use positive and negative imperatives. Additionally, you'll practice a conversation which illustrates how this topic is used in a real life setting. Let's get started by listening to a conversation titled, Don't Work Too Hard. Let's listen and practice. Don't work too hard. Hello, Ms. West. How are you today? Not so good. So what's wrong exactly? I'm exhausted. Hmm. Why are you so tired? I don't know. I just can't sleep at night. Okay, let's take a look at you. I'm going to give you some pills. Take one pill every night after dinner. Okay. And don't drink coffee, tea, or soda. Anything else? Yes. Don't work too hard. All right. Thanks, Dr. Young. The conversation that we just heard illustrates the conversation between a doctor and a patient. Typically, whenever we are sick and we go to the doctor, we're going to receive instructions from the doctor so that we can get better. We use imperatives to give instructions. Imperatives. Take a pill every four hours. Rest in bed. Drink lots of juice. Don't work too hard. Don't stay up late. Don't drink soda. To form imperatives is very simple. Just add the verb. No subject is necessary. Then a complement. On the left hand side of the chart, we can see positive imperatives. Let's analyze them. Take a pill every four hours. The verb is take. The complement is a pill every four hours. On the right hand side of the chart, you can see negative imperatives. Don't work too hard. In this case, we're going to follow this next formula. Don't plus verb plus complement. Don't work is the verb and the complement too hard. Now, I would like for you to give some examples of your own. Think of the advice or instructions that you or your doctor gives whenever you have some kind of illness. For example, if you have a cold, take cough syrup, don't drink cold drinks. After you finish this task, share your Now, for this activity, I would like for us to practice the conversation. Practice the conversation. Everybody, please listen and repeat. Listen and repeat. Are you ready? Hello. Yes. Hello, yes, Ms. West. Very. How are you today? Hello, Hello Ms. Ms. West. How are you? How are you, How are you today? today? Uh, not so good. Not so good. So, what's wrong exactly? So, so what's, what's wrong, wrong exactly? exactly? I'm exhausted. I'm I am so exhausted. exhausted. Hmm, why are you so tired? Mm -hmm. Why are you so tired? I don't know. I just can't sleep at night. I don't, I don't know. know. I just can't can sleep, 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 at night. Night. sleep at night. Okay, let's take a look okay. at you. 
Okay. okay. Let's, let's take a look, look at you. Look, 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 look. A few minutes later. A few, a few minutes, minutes later. Few minutes later. Yeah. I'm going to give you some pills. I'm going, I'm going, going, to, going to give you some pills. pills. Take one pill every night after dinner. Take one pill every night after dinner. Okay. 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 And don't drink coffee, tea, or soda. And don't drink, don't drink coffee, tea, or soda. Anything else? Anything else? Guarde, a mí me quitan el café, el té y la soda. What do you want me to do? It's all what I drink all the day. It's crazy. Okay. Me too. Yeah, that's terrible. Yeah. No, I, normally, I drink coffee in the morning, and then in the morning I drink coffee, in the evening tea, and soda when I have sed. Basically. Every day. <laughs> yeah. Whenever. No excuse. In water. <laughs> uh, water when I'm working. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Anything yeah. else? Anything, Anything else? Anything else? else? Yes. 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 Don't work yeah. too hard. Don't, Don't work too hard. hard. Yo, guarde. Esta doctora no podría hacer mi doctora. I'm sorry. <laughs> All right. Thanks. All, All right. right. Thanks. All right. Dr. Thanks. Young. Dr. Young. Dr. Young. Wow. En vez de decirle, haga ejercicio. En vez de comer hamburguesa, cómese una ensalada. Lo que le está prohibiendo. No vea películas. No vea películas violentas. Ok. So, what we're going to do is, uh, at this moment, do you have any questions referring to this vocabulary? Uh, questions about pronunciation, meaning, anything? And I'm exhausted. Ex ah, what is it? I'm exhausted. Estoy exhausto. Yeah, I'm exhausted. Uh -huh. I'm exhausted. I'm, ex decir que I'm estoy, exhausted. Estoy como quien dice, más de allá que para acá. Right? <laughs> okay, thanks. Todo el día. Yeah, that's exhausted, right? Nosotros decimos exhausted. muerto. Cuando dice cuando le han sacado el jugo en el trabajo que ya no le exprimen ni una gota más de neurona del intelecto porque no hay ok right. another question eh, José, David, José David le voy a pedir que mantenga su micrófono en silencio porque estoy escuchando bastante interferencia de su micrófono Another question, guys? No teacher. No, okay. no, no teacher, no question. No teacher. All right, so we're going to practice this conversation in pairs. Uh, ¿Quién me puede decir qué vamos a hacer ahorita? Practicar la conversación en parejas. Ok, van a practicar la conversación en parejas. En parejas. ¿Cuál conversación van a practicar? La del doctor. La del doctor. That's right. That's right. ¿En qué sección está esa? 2.8. Ok, vaya. Ya, pues ya sabemos todos lo que vamos a hacer. ¿Puedo mandar la imagen al grupo, please? Claro que sí. En este momento. Vamos a ver. Esta es. Vaya, sonrisa. Don't work too hard. Sonrisa. Whiskey. Okay. Yay. <laughs> Just to, una okay. captura de pantalla le hice. Okay. <laughs> Ready y nos fuimos. Ready y nos fuimos. Ya les mando la, la imagen. Si tiene alguna consulta sobre la pronunciación o alguna palabra, levanta la mano y yo le iré a apoyar.
Okay. Let's take a look at you. A I am few... going. <clears throat> Sigo yo mismo. Sí, sí, sí. I am going to give you some pills. Take one pill every night after dinner. Okay. And don't drink coffee, tea, or soda. Anything also. Um, yes, don't work too hard. All right, thanks, Dr. Yun. Ahora podemos invertir si quiere. Sí, bueno. Okay. Hello, Mr. West. How are you today? Not so good. So, what ground exactly? I am at Southern. Mm, why are you so tired? I don't know. I just can't sleep at night. Okay, let's take a look at you. I'm I am going to give you some pie. Take one pie every night after dinner. Okay. Don't drink coffee, tea, or soda. Anything else? Yes, don't work too hard. All right. Thanks, Dr. John. Okay. No sé qué más vamos a hacer. Solo practicar, ¿verdad? Sí, sí. Solo quiero ver. Lo podemos volver a hacer, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. right. Este ahí donde dice eh, que tome píldora, yo creo que es, eh, se dice pil, así como se escribe. Pills. Ajá, pil. Ah, ok. Ajá. Pills. Ahora soy, soy la doctora otra vez. Sí. <coughs> otra ronda. Okay. <risa> Ese Miss, es Miss, ¿verdad? No es Mister, es Miss. No, es Miss. Ajá. Ok. <risa> Pero en su caso es Mister. <risa> ah. <risa> uh, ok. Uh, hello, Mr. West. How are you today? Not so good. So what's wrong exactly? I am exhaust, exhausted. Uh -huh, exhausted. 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 I uh -huh, no sé exactamente cómo se pronuncia exhaust. Lo voy a buscar. Exciting. 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 Creo que sí. Bueno, eh, sigo yo. Mm, okay. Why are you two? Okay. okay, let's take a look at you. Okay. You have the minor letter. Um. Okay. okay. <laughs> I, I going to give you some pills. Take uh, one pill ever. Okay. 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 Rosa, ¿por dónde va? Um, Repeat, please. Okay. Le dije, okay, let's take a look at you. A few minutes later. Uh -huh. I okay. don't know. Some prayer. Take one prayer every night after the dinner. Okay. Um, don't drink um, drink coffee tea, 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 
soda? Anything else? Is everybody finished or do you need more time? Finish. 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 Okay, let me have two volunteers. Two volunteers. Okay, Carlos. Me teacher, me teacher, me teacher. No, 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 no. No vamos a decir me. ¿Cómo lo vamos a hacer? Levantando la hmm. mano. Okay, eh, veo que Marilyn levantó la mano. Gerson, Luis, Melis, Paola y Saúl. Okay, solo vamos a hacer tres prácticas porque de ahí tenemos que continuar. Vamos a trabajar Marilyn y Carlos Javier. Carlos Javier, usted es doctor. Uh, Dr. Young y Madeline, usted es uh, Miss West. Okay, teacher. Action. Hello. Eh, ¿podría, ¿Podría poner la conversación? Yes. Okay. Thank you. Yes. Thank you, teacher. Hello, Mr. West. How are you today? Not so good. So, what's going on exactly? I'm exhausted. Mm, what is the title? I don't know. I just can't sleep at night. Okay, let's take a look at you. Uh, a few five... minutes later. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to give some pills. Take one pill every night after dinner. Okay. And don't drink coffee, there or soda. Anything else? T. Uh -huh. La pronunciación es T. La A no se pronuncia. T. Oh, okay, sorry. I don't drink coffee, tea, or soda. Anything else? Yes. Don't work too hard. All right. Thanks, Dr. John. All right, excellent. Applause for Carlos and Marilyn. Okay, let me have two more. Uh, I'm gonna select um, Saul Arnulfo is going to be Dr. Young and Paola Aranzame is going to be um, Miss West. Action. Okay. Um, hello, Mr. West. How are you today? Not so good. So, what's wrong exactly? I'm exhausted. Um, why are you so tired? I don't know. I just can't sleep at night. Okay, let's take a look at you a few minutes later. I am going to give you some pills. Take one pill. <laughs> every night after dinner. Okay. And don't drink coffee or and don't drink coffee, tea or soda. Anything else? Yes, don't work too hard. All right. Thanks, Dr. Young. You're welcome. Perfect. Perfect. Good job, ladies and gentlemen. Awesome work. Okay, now uh, what we're going to do for the next activity, I would like for us to go to Boca Roo. Do you remember Boca Roo? Yes. Okay, so you're going to go yes. to Boca Roo <clears throat> and you're going to record your voice. Okay, you're going to record your voice reading the conversation. Are you ready? <clears throat> okay, so this is what you're gonna do. You're gonna go to Google. You're gonna write Vocaru. <clears throat> you're gonna go to Vocaru online, record, and you're going to record the conversation. 
Hello, Miss West. How are you today? Not so good. So what's going on exactly? I'm exhausted. Hmm, why are you so tired? I don't know. I just can't sleep at night. Then you are going to stop, <clears throat> listen, the conversation. Hello, Miss West. How are you today? Not so good. So what's going on exactly? I'm exhausted. Hmm, why are you so tired? I don't know. I just can't sleep at night. Then you are going to stop and guardar y compartir. <clears throat> Copy the link. Go to the platform. Come down where it says añade una publicación. Hi. Hi. Desde el teléfono, ¿cómo se hace? Solo se copia el link y se pega ahí. Nada más. Yes, exactly. Ok, es que cuando veo se me sale súper largo. No sé si es okay. normal. Uh, Gabriela, give me one moment. Let me finish right here. And then I will help you. Ok. <clears throat> ok. Then where it says título, you're going to write the title, which is... Don't work too hard. No, doctors uh, visit conversation. And then here you're going to paste the audio link and then enviar. After that, I am going to be able to look at your audio and listen to your pronunciation. And you're going to record the conversation. Hello, Ms. West. <clears throat> Any questions? How are you today? Not so good. No, Any teacher. questions? No, no, teacher. Okay, Gabriela Gomez, what is your question? Solamente, o sea, yo del teléfono copio el link, solamente lo tengo que pegar ahí en that's correct that is correct that's it okay uh see ahorita no vamos a hacer esto guys uh, this is your homework this is your uh, okay because okay. Right, right now we don't have time we got to move on so now for the next activity we're going to be looking at the knowledge check acuérdense que ahora ya es miércoles mañana es jueves Tenemos que terminar sections one, two, three, y el midterm exam. Para empezar semana tres, section four, y semana cinco, di, perdón, semana cuatro, section five, y el final exam. <clears throat> okay. Let's look at the knowledge check instructions. Complete these sentences. Use the words in the box. Instrucciones. Complete estas horas. Ok, si está haciendo ruido, por favor ponga su micrófono en silencio. ¿Quién tiene, es, ¿quién tiene el micrófono no, no en silencio? All right, come on guys, you gotta put your microphone on silence. Ok. Um, repeat please. Call. Stay. Call. Stay. Stay. Don't go. Don't, Don't go. go. Don't drink. Don't drink. Don't drink. See. 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 Take. 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 Don't worry. Don't worry. Don't, worry. Don't, eat. Don't eat. Don't eat. Any questions related to the meaning of these words? Any questions to the meaning of these words? No question. No question. No question. No question. All right. So, oh, yeah, yes, yes. Yes. Stay? Eh, stay. Ah, stay. Eh, stay mm -hmm. es como cuando digamos que... <laughs> José David, José David, por favor, mantenga el micrófono en silencio, José David. Uh, stay. Teacher, estaba en mudo, teacher. Usted que lo está administrando, teacher. Discúlpeme. Yo okay. lo tengo en mudo. Ahorita lo acabo de habilitar por lo que me acaba de decir usted, pero yo lo tengo en mudo. Okay. 
uh, stay es como cuando usted visita a su mamá y se le hace noche y le dice a su mamá, quédate. Quédate. Stay. Oh, ok. Mm -hmm. Quédate. Hey, thank you. Thank you, uh -huh. teacher. Ya. Yeah. O cuando viene el, viene el perro y tú no quieres que te ensucie. Y tú le dices, hey, 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 stay, stay. Mm -hmm. All right, quédate, okay. quédate. Uh -huh. Yes. All right. Thank you. Very good. Another question? Another no, question? Don't worry. Don't worry. Don't worry. Ah, like Bob Marley. Don't worry. Don't be worry. Happy. Be happy. Here Como tranquilo. No I te wrote. preocupes. That's right. Tranquilo, no te preocupes. Calmado. Don't worry. Be happy. Here's a little song I wrote. You might want to sing it note for note. Don't worry. Be happy. Esas son canciones, guys, que ustedes pueden empezar ya a, a cantar. Usted se va a, okay. a YouTube. Ajá, son canciones suavecitas, buen mensaje, buena vibra. Y, y te ayuda a agarrar ritmo. Right? Cuando estás hablando, te ayuda a agarrar ritmo, a entender más palabras. So it's a good exercise. A mí me encanta el karaoke. Yo practico canciones... Ahorita me estoy memorizando uh, una canción para cantársela a una querida muy importante para mí. Así que eh, uh. es una nueva canción. No sé si la han escuchado de Michael Jackson. The way you make me feel. You rock my world. Oh, yeah. Ajá. Esa le quiero yeah, cantar yeah. En, un, en un karaoke. Así I que todos to los... Yeah, todos los días. Uh, I can't put it on the on the video because YouTube, he, you know, but I'm going to write it for you on WhatsApp. The name is Rock My World. And uh, yeah, uh, I'm going to sing it for her in a karaoke one day. All right, let's look at the first one. A dentist. A dentist. What? A dentist. Uh, what uh call see stay take see see a dentist ah call. see a dentist call, call. call. A dentist okay call all right you can say yeah call see a dentist see a dentist all right i'm going to give you five minutes for you to uh work on this activity and then we are going to check together. Any questions? No teacher. No teacher. Okay. No. Ready? Let's go. Yo ya lo hice. Okay, excellent. Si ya lo hizo, le ayuda a eh, Melody, usted está con Let me see. Si usted ya lo hizo, guys, usted le puede ayudar a su compañero, ¿ok? No tenga pena. Ok. Uh -huh. Melody va con... Con Beatriz. Let's go, let's go. Gabriela, Jose David, Melody, let's go, let's go. Uh, Beatriz, let's go, let's go. No han entrado. Gabriela, Jose David, Beatriz, let's go, let's go. Beatriz, usted está con mi ladies, Barahona. Muy bien, ya estoy aquí. Ok, en la one, si hay dentis, no, es Carl, Carl, en tú, en tú, I don't know. 
Eh, don't worry too much. Ah, okay, okay, very well. Eh, in the tree, take to aspirin. Yes. Okay. Four, don't go to school. Yes. Okay. Five, stay in bed. Excellent. Okay. And six, eh, see a doctor. Yes. Okay. Seven, don't drink coffee. Yes, aunque triste, me gusta el café. <risa> yo soy más a la, a la soda. <risa> bueno, yo los dos, pero me gusta el café para el desayuno y cena. Ah, yo para el desayuno. Cena igual lo tomo, pero si hay otra cosa, prefiero uh, soda. Casi que estoy todo el día. Casi que solo porque me hace daño. <risa> y bueno, y el egg don't eat any candy. Yes. Yes. Okay. Sí. Very good. Solo, solo una duda. Eh, Dígame. ¿Por qué en la oración primera no era sí, sino que call? Porque yo había considerado que la six fuera call a doctor. Y en la uno ah. era si a dentist. Pues creo que ahí es más que todo por este orden de la plataforma. Porque como tanto el dentista como el doctor son este, personas importantes, pero creo que les den más atención a la salud vocal. Bucal. Sí, porque este, igual a los dos tienes que ver, pienso yo, ¿verdad? Yeah. Sí, no, pues claro. Ajá, entonces yo había analizado que fuera como ver al dentista y llamar al doctor. Y al final, pues, fue al revés. Ajá, exacto. Entonces, por eso me dio curiosidad que quizás era por la estructura de la oración, pero creo que aquí es más como lo pone la plataforma. ¿verdad? Sí, porque no, uno se rige por lo que dice la plataforma. Ajá, de la plataforma. Gracias, Carlos. Muy amable. Sí, ya los subí y todas me salieron buenas. Excelente, excelente. Vamos a ver si, vamos a ver si el teacher no nos pone a... A, a, a responderlas. Ajá. Este, este docente es más interactivo. Yes, es cierto. Y me gusta porque, o sea, bueno, en mi caso que vengo muy noche a trabajar, me gusta porque me hace trabajar ya directamente en la plataforma. Entonces es como que este tiempo es directamente para, para trabajar en la plataforma. La verdad a mí me gusta porque no siento el tiempo Ajá. y estoy aprendiendo. Sí, él, él te hace, o sea, te obliga a hablar, a practice, practice pronunciation, ¿verdad? Eh, te ayuda como a desenvolverte la lengua, como dicen, suelta la lengua. Es cierto. A saber, eh, quiera o no quiera uno, pero lo tiene que hacer. Exacto, y como que te quita el miedo, va. Es, va y poco a poco uno va dominando eso. Uh -huh. Entonces, esa, es, esa es la parte que me ha gustado de, de cómo él interactúa con la, con la clase. Yo le decía ayer a, a alguien con el que hice el grupo, le deseo que al inicio me dio miedo porque yo el jueves de la semana pasada no pude estar por el trabajo y hasta el lunes que recibí clase de nuevo. Y me dio miedo cuando lo vi a él que salió y empezó a hablar en inglés. Me entró un pánico horrible, un pánico escénico y yo y me equivoqué de clase, ¿verdad? ¿no? O sea, fue lo primero que pensé, me equivoqué de clase, no es este mi grupo, ¿va? Entonces, este, inclusive cuando una de las compañeras preguntó si era el módulo 3 de básico, y él dijo sí, entonces ya dije, ah, ah pues sí, dije yo, ese es el correcto, dije yo. Pues yo estoy no tranquila. Qué. Ajá, ¿verdad? Pero ustedes todavía lo dio la docente o lo dio ya él. Eh, yo hasta este módulo que lo he conocido, él. ¿eh? No, pero el jueves pasado lo dio todavía la teacher o lo dio él? El, el teacher. Ah. Sí, el teacher. Ella no se conectó. Ah, ok, ok. Bueno, con gusto, Carlos. Y gracias. Igual. Por...
All right, let's go ahead and check it, everybody. Number one, number two. Too much? All dentist. Don't worry too much. Very good. Don't worry too much. Don't worry too much. Number three. <laughs> Take, Take, go to Take two aspirin. Take two aspirin. Take. Take. Number four. Yes. Don't, don't go to school. Uh, alguien dijo teacher? Yes. Uh, the one. Jennifer. Sí. En la primera oración no es sí, es call. Call a dentist. Yes. Okay, thank you. Number four. Don't, don't go, go to school. Don't go to school. Yes. Don't go <laughs> to school. Yeah. Cool. Don't go to school. Oh my God. Uh, number five. Stay in bed. Stay in bed. Stay in bed. Number six. See a doctor. Don't drink. Don't drink a doctor. See a doctor. Number seven. Don't drink coffee. Don't drink, don't drink coffee. coffee. Don't drink coffee. Don't drink Number eight. Don't, 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 eat, eat, don't, don't eat, eat, candy. eat any candy. Don't eat any candy. Este doctor no puede ser mi doctor. I love, yo mantengo chocolates, Hershey's, Twix, yeah, Snickers, M&M's. Ahí están en la refri. Waiting for Give me. me. Yes, of course. All right. Excellent, guys. Any questions? No, teacher. No, no teacher. All right. No, teacher. Okay. Now we're going to look at 2.10. By the end of this class, you will read and discuss an article about how to improve your health. Additionally, you will develop skills in scanning and reading for main ideas. Al final de esta clase, ustedes leerán y discutirán un artículo acerca de cómo mejorar la salud. Adicionalmente, desarrollarán habilidades en la lectura y la detección de ideas principales. Any questions right now? No, teacher. No, okay. teacher. Let's listen, please. It's simple. Hi everyone, in this class you'll develop skills in scanning and reading for main ideas by reading and discussing an article about how to improve your health. 10 Simple Ways to Improve Your Health Believe it or not, you can greatly improve your health in 10 simple ways. 1. Eat breakfast. Breakfast gives you energy for the morning. 2. Go for a walk. Walking is good exercise, and exercise is necessary for good health. 3. Floss your teeth. Don't just brush them. Flossing keeps your gums healthy. 4. Drink 8 cups of water every day. Water helps your body in many ways. 5. Stretch for 5 minutes. Stretching is important for your muscles. 6. Wear a seat belt. Every year, seat belts save thousands of lives. 7. Do something to challenge your brain. For example, do a crossword puzzle or read a new book. 8. Protect your skin. Use lots of moisturizer and sunscreen. 9. Get enough calcium. Your bones need it. Dairy foods, like yogurt, milk, and cheese, have calcium. 10. Take a time out. A break of about 20 minutes. Do something different. For example, get up and walk. Or sit down and listen to music. All right, guys, um, on this yeah. article, we are going to look at simple ways. But because of the time, we really cannot get into details with the exercise. So I would like for us to practice pronunciation. 
we're going to practice the pronunciation of the article. Are you ready? Yes, Repeat, sir. please. Ten yeah. simple ways. Ten simple ways. Simple way. To improve your health. To improve, to improve your, your health. health. Believe it or yeah. not. Believe it or not. Believe it or not. Believe it or not. Not. You can greatly improve your health in 10 simple ways. You can greatly improve your health in 10 simple ways. Eat breakfast. Eat breakfast. Breakfast gives you energy. For the morning. For the morning. Go for a walk. Go for, for a walk. walk. Walking walk. is a good exercise. Walking is a good exercise. exercise. And exercise is necessary for good health. And exercise is necessary for good health. Floss your teeth. Floss your teeth. Don't, don't just brush them. Don't, don't just, just brush them. them. Flossing keeps your gums healthy. Flossing keeps your gums healthy. healthy. Don't uh, drink eight cups of water every day. Drunk, no, drunk, no, no, drunk, drunk, no, drink, drink. Every day. Water helps your body in many ways. Water helps your body in many ways. In many ways. Stretch for five minutes. Stretch. No, no. Stretch. No. Stretch. 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 Okay, guys, I, I got to let you go. It's already 9 o'clock. I have another class. So your homework is going to be to read the text and record on Boca Roo. And yes. then paste it here in the Añade Una Publicación discussion forum. Bye bye guys. Good night. Bye teacher. Bye. 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 Bye